Howdy folks, this is Justro at Metcalf Mills bringing you Fun Fact Friday because this day and time, facts are hard to come by. I got a good one for you today. It's a little trick for your household, a little household trick for your old wall clock or your grandfather clock or any big clock. But it's got to be an old clock or a mechanical clock. That means a wind-up clock. I hope you enjoy it. Now, folks, when you're talking about the old-timey clocks, they're all mechanical. They got springs in there, and they wind up. Or you got weights that make them run. There's different ways that they <clears throat> operate, but one thing is important, and that's to keep them clocks running good and smooth and not wearing out. And the way to do that is an old trick that my grandpa used to do, and then as well as some other old-timers, is you take a little lid off of something or a little teeny cup and put you some kerosene oil in there and just set it right in the clock, right inside the clock. And just that oil being in there will just, I guess, saturate the air with the whatever's coming off of that oil, the fumes or whatever, and it'll keep your clock in good shape. And I'll show you how I do that and what I do. So right here, I've just got a solid one-piece can lid, jar lid, and my oil lamp, one of my oil lamps here, and what I do is just, I pour oil out of the lamp into this uh, lid. It's the easiest way to do it here in the house. You don't have to fool with a big uh, can or jug or anything. That's what I do to keep my uh, lid topped off with oil to go in my clock. All right, what we're gonna do, just open this clock up, and right here in the bottom right here, we're going to get our oil very gently without spilling it. Set it up here. Slide it right into place. And now, we've got a full-time lubrication system for our clock right here to keep all them gears and everything up in there working good. But that's what you do. Now, I've got a little thing of old clock oil here that I bought, but that ain't nothing to what this will do. I used that clock oil once, and it's just no comparison. Just keep your, keep your kerosene oil in your clock, and this works on any kind of a mechanical clock, old wind-up, striking clocks, wall clocks, mantle clocks, grandfather clocks, any of that stuff that's mechanical and winds up. And what that means is... They've got, like I said, they got different systems, but this particular old clock, I've done a video on it once, it's got a key. You put it right in here, and you turn that to wind this clock up, and same for the other side right here. And one side is for the chime, one side is for the striking of it, and one side is for the running of it. And this is a 30-day clock right here. Now keep in mind, it is getting probably around 50 years old, so it ain't hardly a 30-day clock no more. But it's a Seiko. Come from over in Thailand. When one of our cousins was in the military over there, he sent it back to my grandparents, and I was fortunate enough to, Daddy was, to get it and keep it, you know, here, and we're real thankful for this clock. It's, it's seen a lot of good times and a lot of sad times, I guess, but... I'm thankful for it. It strikes the airs out, every air, one or two or three, and then a half air, it strikes one time. So we're, it's, a, it's a special clock, and if you've got a special clock or you've got a clock that you need to take care of, you keep that cup of oil sitting in there all the time, and that'll do it for you. Folks, I hope you enjoyed today's Fun Fact Friday. I know it's a lot shorter than the videos that I've been putting out lately, but I, I kind of hate to make them so long, but they just turn out long, and I go through and cut out every little piece I can, but maybe I'm talking too much. I don't know. I hope you are enjoying it, though, and this Friday evening, I hope you enjoy today's Fun Fact Friday. If you don't have an old clock... Maybe one day you will have one and can put this to use. Maybe you already have one and can put it to use. Or maybe you just enjoy the video. Either way, I hope it helps you in some way. 
Hope you have a great weekend. Try to spend just a little bit of time this weekend watching Metcalf's Mills videos. Like this video if you liked it. Subscribe if you ain't already. Tell your friends about me. And don't forget to wind your clock. This is Justro at Metcalf Mills. I look forward to seeing you real soon.